Hey guys, so this morning we were talking and he was in Illinois. I was in Tennessee. We decided we were ready for a change of pace and change of scenery. Change of scenery, Completely change of change of scenery. Right? And a change of temperature. So we pulled a few campgrounds. Found a campground that had availability and it wasn't stupid crazy. So I packed up the camper in like three hours. Yeah, roughly three hours. And it drove about five to meet me. Yeah, met him in Illinois. Hey, and don't walk through there. We the are lanes, please. we're stopped now at a Love's. <laughs> we're actually gonna be sleeping in his truck because it has air conditioning and the camper does not. We need a generator. Yeah, we do need to get a generator for the camper. Um, we had one, but it was small, didn't really work great. Um, so yeah, we're not going to say where we're headed yet. We will share that really? when we get there. But, we're super excited. And we've been trying to get out west for a long time, that's all I'm going to say. I think kind of let that slip. Right? <laughs> we've only done it in the semi. Yeah. And we'll see what happens. It's gonna be fun. All right, so we've already started this and we realized that we should have been filming it um, or recording it because nobody uses film anymore, right? Uh, so our water pump just vibrates like very softly. It doesn't actually kick on. There's no water pressure, nothing. Um, so we're trying to figure out what's going on. And we watched another video on YouTube of a guy that kind of had a similar problem and he took everything apart uh, off the top of the water pump right there, so that's what we're gonna do here. She's trying to disconnect the power, so we don't have any issues. Did you pull that up, that clear one yeah, out? Yeah, somebody put this black stuff. Oh, nice. All over it. You want a knife to kind of cut it off? <laughs> Didn't come out. Let's see if we can see here. Here. No, I'm not just wait. No. Oh. Oh. So we need to make sure these do not short out. One of them is the ground. One of them is the hot. I need the drill back. I need the drill. All right. <laughs> Here's your screws. Here, tray for some screws. You can take them all the way out, I guess. Right, just yeah. Well, it's been a while since we've used our water pump. Yeah, we haven't used it since the last time the RV was back at Heartland for some repairs. This thing has been back, like we've said multiple times in our videos, like six times. I need to know so about why. Yeah. Yeah, stay tuned for a future video because we will definitely do uh, an explanation on why it's been back so many times and all that good stuff. Oh, it's stuck. Just like you said. Yeah. A little valve. Aha! Now it moves. <laughs> so just like that. We're gonna put it back together. It's hold this on, button. hold on, let it focus here. Yeah, this little little valve is what he said in that video, so that's what we did. We'll link that video below to give him a shout out because I greatly appreciate that being out there. Oh yeah. Definitely. Everybody else's videos were basically buying new you water. Got water pump. in that, so be careful. Oh no. But everybody else is saying, basically, you need to buy a new water pump, and clearly, we don't. Hopefully. Make they sure that goes on the correct way, the way you took it off. No, no. Should go like that, yeah. <laughs> That's all we need to do, right? Put it on backwards. That's the right way. Because the mount is on this side towards me. So yeah, we're going to put all this back together and see uh, 
how it goes. Hopefully, Hopefully this fixes our problem. So we got it all hooked back up. Got the pump back on. Now we're gonna check the water. We're boondocking, so that's why there's stuff everywhere right now. Well, we have water. Still got some air in the lines, but hey, we have water. <laughs> so I just realized we never finished our video about the water pump. Um, what ended up happening is one of the valves was turned on that was supposed to be turned off. Um, so we fixed that and our water came through just fine. Our water pump has been working great ever since we fixed it. Um, again, I'm going to link the guy's video below that showed us how because he definitely deserves a shout out. Uh, and yeah, so we'll bring you along for the rest of our journey, but that's it for this video. And we hope that you like, share, and subscribe to our channel and we'll see you next time. Bye.